the managing director and CEO of the transmission company of Nigeria, Suli Abdulaziz, has pointed out the infrastructure issues plaguing the power sector, emphasizing that a significant portion of the equipment is outdated. Abdulaziz shared this information during his appearance on Channel Television's Sunday Politics program, where he provided insight into the causes of the recurring grid failures in the country. He said, the transmission system needs a lot of investment and for so many years in this country, that sector has been neglected. Most of the equipment we use is 50 years or 40 years, so it is not possible for those infrastructure to work perfectly. Abdulaziz also stated that the transmission company of Nigeria is putting in place a backup system to avoid future collapses and prevent a nationwide blackout in case of a failure in the national grid. He also mentioned that they are currently implementing the scattered system for the entire network funded by the World Bank with a completion timeline of two years, 70% of the project has been accomplished. Also, according to Abdulaziz, there is an ongoing upgrade on all transmission lines and the CCN has been partnering with private companies to mobilize funds. The Honorable Minister Yesom Wike is mentioned in the interview as currently collaborating with the presidency to secure approval for what is referred to as the super grid. Further insight from the MD and CEO of TCN details that once this super grid is in place, a fault in transmission line can be taken care of by a switch to an alternative line, a backup system which our current grid does not have. In conclusion, he expressed optimism about achieving a consistent electricity supply across Nigeria within five years.